West Coast and Fremantle thoughts from the weekend. West Coast lose, Fremantle win, finally. Uh, let's get into both of them. Let's start with Freo, shall we? Amos, I reckon he's a star. Get him in there. Does Tabana lose his spot for good now? I don't know. Where does Josh Tracy sit? That's another question. But they're small brigade. Love him. Mickey Walters, he does what he does. Uh, Schultz was very good on the weekend. Hopefully Swickowski injury isn't too bad, but they're small forwards. When firing, can make this forward line work. Um, Fremantle are top four in inside 50s, but bottom four in conversions before last round. So uh, they kick some goals, but I still, look, the win they had, great. You can only win with what's in front of you, but it wasn't this all-encompassing, convincing victory, was it? Like... They beat the Gold Coast Sun. They, they probably should have been down by more at half time, but they get it done. So there's got to be some element, uh, an element of confidence come out of that win. They move forward to next week and they go on to bigger and better things. And hopefully Flag Mandel is somewhat on the return. The West Coast Eagles on the other side lose to the defending premiers in Geelong and it was a bloodbath. Uh, it could have been a bl- bigger bloodbath. I thought at half time when I went to have a couple of beers... I was going to come back to a 200-point loss. But they fought on. I think West Coast fans should be somewhat pleased with the resilience and fight the players had. No, there's no such thing as a good good loss. This is still a loss. It's not a victory. But at least... Uh, there wasn't, uh, well, at least there wasn't eight injuries and at least it wasn't 200 point loss like we saw in the waffle effectively. That's another story. I don't think what's happening at the waffle is going to be um, something that can continue for the West Coast Eagles for too much longer. They're going to have to find a solution and perhaps before the end of the year. Um, I don't know if that situation's tenable for much longer than what it is right now. Uh, Oscar Allen, very good. Jake Waterman, very good at AFL level. I like what those two are doing. And you know what? Bailey Williams as a ruckman kind of works. What do you reckon? Fremantle fans, tell me what you think. Are you happy? Are you sad? Flag Mantle, is it back? Or uh, was that just a victory that maybe couldn't have been? West Coast Eagles, yes or no? Are they cooked for the year?